This green section here is the plastid, which is creating energy, which is this coal, from the solar power. Down here, this red section is the storage, which is the which represents the vacuoles. And over here is also a sto storage section, another vacuole, which is storing a liquid. The cyan section represents a peroxisome, which turns the long-chained hydrocarbons into shorter ones through cracking, and real peroxisomes break down long-chained fats. The yellow section here is the mitochondria, which generates power. As you can see, the coal is coming in here, and it is going into these steam engines. The blue section is the nucleus, which holds all the genetic information. The robopore in the middle represents the nucleolus, which helps transport molecules, which deploying the robots. The paths of the robots represent the endoplasmic retic reticulum, because materials are being transported across it. Up here, this gray section is the Golgi body, which serves to package and transport. The factory floor represents the cytoplasm. Train comes in, and it starts filling up the train with assorted molecules. This wall is the, represents the cell wall, and this structure here represents the ribosome. It has its own circular strand of DNA, and it creates proteins from this string of RNA. Th this string is just a sample loop, but real ribosomes only use the RNA once, and they don't have a loop. Finally, these turrets on the edge represent the cell membrane, which lets nutrients through and help protect against intruders.